a wide receiver that you guys have asked a lot about. In fact, two wide receivers uh, of some note at a certain level have signed their contracts with the Cowboys. Futures contracts, this is. This is the building of the 90-man roster for 2023. Mike Fisher reporting from Frisco. Antonio Callaway uh, is staying with the Cowboys. He never obviously got the bump up to the varsity. He did get an opportunity uh, to be in the building, impressed enough to stay in the building on the practice squad, uh, a guy that they wanted to take a look at initially and see just where he was at. And apparently where he was at is not too bad. And then also uh, coming back to the Cowboys via a futures contract is another wide receiver, Dennis Houston, who, of course, started the 2022 season on the actual 53-man roster on the varsity. So signed up so far for Dallas on the futures is Houston and Callaway and Dontario Drummond, also a wide receiver, three offensive linemen, Alex Taylor, a tackle, Alec Lindstrom, a center, and Brock Hoffman, uh, some versatility as an offensive lineman. And then the defensive backs, uh, Wanye Thomas, Tyler Coyle, and Sheldrick Redwine. They can continue to build that uh, that 90-man roster using futures contracts. In the case of Callaway, certainly understand uh, why Cowboy Nation wants to know a little more and see a little more. His rookie year in Cleveland, after having been a fourth-round pick, he catches 43 passes and five touchdowns uh, before behavioral issues sidelined him there. So a second chance with Callaway and the Cowboys over the course of this past regular season. And now, because he gets a futures contract going forward for 2023, in a sense, a third chance for Antonio Callaway and the Cowboys. In Frisco, Fish out.